Hello, let's do Wordle number 543, and for the classical music theme, Cloudy Apple 18 suggested Beethoven, but you know, of course you have to split it into two five-letter words, and I checked and these are accepted words, so we're going to start with Beats and Hoven, and Beethoven is one of my favorite classical music composers, although he is from the end of classical, beginning of romantic period, but when we say classical music in common parlance, we mean a large range of periods that encompass the classical music per period, and really we just mean, you know, composers of that, those past eras. <laughs> so if anyone has a good definition of the common parlance for classical music, um, I've never really encountered one that satisfied me, so leave a comment if you do. Uh, anyway, Beethoven got us a single S, which is uh, pretty funny because Beethoven doesn't actually have an S in it, but let's see what we can do with that. So S I usually like to start with, especially if it's not at the end. Well, S is actually rarely at the end because they removed all the words where S is at the end. But let's see here. I think slack is a good guess here. That gets us some good letters. We could also do slick, but I think A is more common than I. So let's try that. Wow, okay, so I got S, L, and A, but they're all out of place. So how does that work? Um, oh, I thought of lasso, but uh, there's no O in the word, so it can't be. But maybe it is L-A-S something. What could that be? Can't be laser, because there's no E. Well, I feel like this is very close. <laughs> Lassie the dog? I don't think so. I wonder if it's L, A, Ooh, it could be... So no, we can't do something L.A. because they're yellow there. I was going to say it was something L.A. But I'm thinking ending in S.Y. So, like, it would, I guess it would be, like, L.A. something S.Y. I don't see what that would be. Or, or it could be something A.L.S.Y. Like, palsy? I'm going to try palsy. Seems odd for that to be an answer, but we'll see. Yeah, it's not the answer. All right, well, we found more places that A, L, and S aren't. So this, okay, so it's not L, A, S either. Where does the A, maybe we start with A then? I mean, A could be in the first, fourth, or fifth slots though. But where do the, uh, maybe it ends in A, L then. Ooh, it could end in S, A, L. Can't be basil. Oh, this is weird. I am on the fifth guess. Should I do a filler? It doesn't feel like I need to, but let me think about what this could be. We could also end in double L, but then we'd have to start with A if we did that. Because double L at the end would use up all of the places for A otherwise. Um, so we do something like A, S, something double L. But that doesn't look right to me. It really does feel like S, A, L ending is the best possible one, or the most likely. Or we could start with A and end with S-I-L or S-U-L. I don't see it. This is, this is weird. A-S something I-L? This is a strange unscramble. The other option would be something like ending in L-A. So we could do like, put an S somewhere in here and then end in L-A. I keep seeing salsa, but it's not because of where our yellows are. Ooh, wait, wait, uh... No, we can't, we can't do anything like that. Okay, well, still S-A-L feels the best, but I can't think of any words for it, so maybe it's not the best. If I did a filler, it, it's hard because I'd want to at least try to get a couple greens out, one or two greens out of the, the yellows I have, and then also find out what the other letters are. And I'm debating which is more important. Because <clears throat> if I got all grays, I mean, even that would help because it narrows down what I could do. But also, it really helps to narrow down what I can do by getting greens. So what would... Like something like drill, for example. DR and I are brand new, and then I would know exactly where the L goes at the end of this. No matter what happens, I'd know where the L goes. So that's one really good possibility for a filler. Um, but I don't. it doesn't tell me anything about the A or the S, but those are already really limited. Like, the S is already in just the second or third spot, and the the A is already in the first, fourth, or fifth slot. And I's like to go with the A's. I wouldn't get the U, but 
I'm trying, I'm basically convincing myself to do drill. Frill might be better. I don't know if F is better than D or grill if G is better than D. I only get one filler. Drill. What, what seems like it would go? I feel like the D would. Actually, I don't know. I feel like D, F, and G are all relatively the same in terms of fitting into this word. I can't think of any words. I don't usually like doing fillers if I can't think of any words because it just means I need to think longer and I'll come up with one. But at the same time, this is a really tough unscramble. All right, I'm just going to do drill then just to, to save some time. All right, we found the L. It's at the end. There is not two L's. That reinforces ending in S-A-L. So it's basically what I expected. We don't have a D or an R. What is it then? S-A-L. Yeah, I'm, this didn't help at all, did it? I mean, it helped a little bit. We know we don't start with L, for example. And the reason we know that is we did do two L's in drill. So we know there's an L at the end, and because this other L is gray, it means there are not two L's in the word, which means there cannot be an L first because there would then be two L's in the word. So th that's how I know that. I know uh, that's one of the more obscure ways that Wordle clues things, so. If this L were yellow with this being green, then we would know there would be an L first. Let's see. We can't put an A second. We could start with A. S, a at, S otherwise could only go here. So then could it be A, S, something, something, L? Maybe ending in U, L then? I am I am struggling so much with this one. This is taking me forever. Something S U A L. Got it. <clears throat> that is an unusual word. No. Oh my gosh. Ooh, that took me so long. Not having the U, and then there's two of them. Yeah, I did not think of U A until it, I basically was forced to. Okay, well. I got it eventually, got it in six. Not my, my proudest solve, but let's do the Wheel of Themes. So let's give that a spin. Ooh, just Miss Tonica, all right. So tomorrow's theme is garden related, suggested by It's Just Ash. So two words related to gardens in some way. And of course, if you enjoyed this content, then why not leave a like and subscribe.